we are hopefully the new contestants on The Amazing Race yes. because when we were homeless in Paris living in a park, Ashley actually said to me, if only we could go on The Amazing Race and we might win some money and be able to get out of this whole situation. I've been watching The Amazing Race forever and we were totally shocked when we found out that Amazing Race was going to Australia. We would be really, really, really great to watch because we're both highly entertaining. I'm telling you why. <laughs> it's true. Like we are highly, highly entertaining. We don't take ourselves too seriously at all. And we're, we're not arrogant. <laughs> um, <laughs> and also, like, so Grace has got really great things about it. For example, she's like the really kind of active one and she gets everything done. She's really super organized. Like, for example, when we were flying to, to move to Paris together, I was at the airport. We'd been planning a trip for like six months and Gracie made me do all this checklist and everything else. And when we finally arrived to the airport to actually board the plane, and the lady says, can I see your passport? I lost my passport. This is as we were boarding onto the plane, we were 19. And then we had to backtrack our steps and we'd been drinking Bailey shots at like at the duty free Which counter. we won't be doing on the amazing race. No. And we like left the passport on the floor. Anyway, thanks to Gracie, we ended up finding it. And but it. then thanks to Ashley, we had everything in our suitcase from hair dryers <laughs> to extension cords and <laughs> mobile phone chargers and everything um and also we just want to kind of visit some new countries totally yeah anywhere just yeah <laughs> like we've ticked in the box anywhere <laughs> um yeah i just think it'd be such an amazing thing for grace and i to do just to, i'm like, worried i'm not even in the video no i can okay, see we, you in the reflection oh, oh, they, oh. um see yeah okay um and also with grace and i We've had such awesome experiences together, but to do something like The Amazing Race would be so yeah. sensational. Well, we lived to... together in a 12 metre apartment on the seventh floor without an elevator for in, six months in Paris. in Paris. So wait, when we say 12 square metres, that's Gracie would stand like that and I would join my arms to hers and you'd touch the walls. And then we had to go to Ikea because there was no bed and there was this single, like, wire. Grand Cooler, its name was. Yeah, so we'd, we'd turn up to Ikea, we've been out like kind of mini stilettos and dresses, dresses and we've We've caught a train, we've caught the TGV, so we're far out, like somewhere in France. We finally get to Ikea, we go to get the bed, you have to pick the pieces individually yourself. Its name is Grand Cooler. Anyway, we only could afford 150 euro, we'd previously been sleeping so in a park. So we home delivery. So they said it'll be an extra 60 euros for the delivery, Maybe and we, we said, run out we don't have that, okay. So we couldn't afford the delivery, so we carried it ourselves. Two 19 year olds, back on the TGV, through Paris, we finally get to our apartment, 164 stairs. And then, to build the bed, and then build it outside the house. We actually slept that bed inside yeah. the house. <laughs> anyway, but we overcome obstacles. What we're trying to say, it doesn't matter what situation. And we're so competitive that we don't, we're not going to lose. We won't lose. We're going to win. We're going to win the money. Yep. Like, crazy I think that's it. Hold on. Oh, we've got six, eight seconds left. Yes. I mean, we're going for the kind of, yeah. yeah. They'll pick the old people and the young. Yeah, we'll be the cool ones. Okay. Yeah.